If you're watching this video, you probably have a USB device that you're trying to connect to WSL. So in this video, I'm going to show you step by step how to set that up. If you're new to my channel, I have a website at kevinwoodrobotics.com where I have a bunch of resources on robotics and computer vision. So check it out and subscribe to learn more. So the first thing you want to do is go ahead and search for PowerShell. So you're going to choose the option Run as Administrator. A window is going to pop up, and you're going to see the administrator up on top. Go ahead and run the first command here, the USB IPD list. This is going to list out all of your USB devices. You're going to choose the one that you're working with. In my case, is the 9-1. You're going to go ahead and bind it using this command called the USB IPD bind dash dash bus ID, and then your ID number, in my case, 9-1. If you've already shared it, then it's going to show this. You can also confirm that it's been shared by looking at the state here where it says shared now. Next, what you want to do is attach the USB device by using this command called the USB IPD attach dash dash WSL dash dash bus ID 9-1. So one thing to note is that if you actually do this before opening Ubuntu, you're going to see this error here that says USB IPD error. There is no WSL2 distribution running. Keep a command prompt to a WSL2 distribution open to leave it running. So what this means is that you don't have a WSL open. So what you want to do is go ahead and open up Ubuntu and then go ahead and run this command again. And you're going to see that now it has successfully um, attach the device, then you should be able to use it in your WSL. Now, when you're all done, you could go ahead and run this command here, USB IPD detach dash dash bus ID 9-1, or you could just go ahead and disconnect your USB device. Okay, so if you found this video helpful, give a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.